Hello students, so welcome to my channel. This video contains Class 8 Cyber Olympiad Previous Year Paper 2021 Question Paper Set B You can also find other Olympiad papers of Class 8 in my channel. I have given the link in the description box. Please do watch. Before going to the video, please do subscribe my channel for more videos. Let's move into the video. The first section is Logical Reasoning. Question number 1. How many such symbols are there in the given arrangement, each of which is immediately preceded by a letter and immediately followed by a number? How many such symbols? So let's mark the symbols first. These are the symbols, right? So now the condition is symbols which is immediately preceded by a letter and immediately followed by a number. Immediately preceded by a letter and immediately followed by a number means here it is again letter. No, it is not followed by a letter. So we will strike out then immediately preceded by a letter as well as followed by a number. So correct then immediately preceded by a letter and immediately followed by a number that's correct then for this symbol immediately preceded by a letter and followed by a number then here it is also correct then for this symbol immediately preceded by a letter but not followed by a number no so we'll strike out here next immediately preceded by a letter and followed by a number so how many such symbols are there totally we have five so hence option c is the right answer question number two in a certain code language if circular is written as some coded word then how will discount be written in that code language for this first we'll write alphabets Okay, now we'll write down the word given word circular. It is coded as V S B. Right. So here the pattern goes like this C D I J R S C D. Similarly, U, V, L, M, A, B, R, S. No? So, the same pattern will follow for the word discount. You can count here. How many letters are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Same letter, no? So, we will split like this. Right. Now, I J the next letter of I is its J so here A B C D E again here C D here S T so here also U V O P then here T U then N O so finally the word discount is coded as J E D T V P U O. So the answer is it's option D. Question number 3. Select a figure from the option as to how the pattern would appear when the transparent sheet is folded along the dotted line. So just analyze the figure. So if the transparent uh, sheet is folded along the dotted line, you will be getting the figure as its option C. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर दर इज़ अ सर्टेन रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन फिगर्स वन एंड टू एस्टाब्लिश अ सिमिलर रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन फिगर्स थ्री एंड फोर बाय सेलेक्टिंग अ सूटेबल फिगर फ्रॉम द गिवन ऑप्शंस दैट वुड रिप्लेस द क्वेश्चन मार्क इन द फिगर फोर सो ये द क्वेश्चन इज नाउ विल फाइंड आउट वॉट इज द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन दीज टू फिगर्स इन द फर्स्ट फिगर द शेप एस फोर साइड्स In second figure, the shape has three sides. So, which means, in the second figure, in second figure, number of sides is one less than the previous one, right? So, in the same way, the third figure it has the shape has six sides. Then, in the fourth figure, the shape must have five sides, right? So, we'll move on to the option. Option B and D. is having a five sided figure right then we'll have a look on the placement of this circle so by observing this placement of the circle we can go with option d question number 5 sudhir was facing south he turned to right and walked 20 meter then he turned right again and walked 10 meter then after turning to left he walked 10 meter he then turned right and walked 20 meter again after turning to right he walked 60 meter which direction is he now with respect to the starting point so in the question it is given that sudhir was facing south so let us assume this is the position of sudhir he was facing south means he must be facing like this so when facing south this must be your right and this must be your left so question is he turned to right and walked 20 meter so he walked about 20 meter then he turned right again and walked 10 meter again this must be your right and this must be your left he walked about 10 meter then after turning to left he walked 10 meter so this is right this is left he walked again 10 meter he then turned right and walked 20 meter so this is left this is right he turned right and walked 20 meter means let us assume this is 20 Again, after turning to right, he walked sixty meter. So this is left. This is right. He walked sixty meter means this is ten. Okay, because this distance no, this is same as ten meter. So ten. Again, this particular distance is twenty. No, up to this. This is twenty. So totally, he has covered thirty. But he is walking ten sixty meter, so will extend up to. Let us consider this is another thirty meter. So finally, he has walked about sixty meters. So this is the final position or destination. So which direction is he now with respect to the starting point? So this is the starting point. No, let's draw the line. We'll connect. So at last, in which direction he is now with respect to the starting point? Let's draw the direction, remaining direction here. Right. So this is north, this is east, this is south, and this is west. So, so at last, ah, uh, he is in north east direction with respect to the starting point. Right. So hence your answer is it's option D. Question number six. Group the given figures into three classes. on the basis of their identical properties using each figure only once so in this uh, given question of uh, figure 1 6 and 4 these three figures have the same identical properties so we'll make a group on this and remaining is figure 2 then figure 9 and figure 4 so 2 4 9 it makes another group then 3 5 8 and we have another group right so finally your answer is 
इट्स ऑप्शन बी इज द राइट आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग टू साइंस मस्ट बी इंटरचेंज टू मेक द गिवन इक्वेशन करेक्ट सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द क्वेश्चन वी नीड टू प्रूव बोथ द राइट हैंड साइड एंड द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड टू बी इक्वल और करेक्ट सो फॉर दिस हियर आई एम गोइंग टू यूज बोर्ड मास रूल टू सॉल्व द इक्वेशन सो वॉट इज बोर्ड मास रूल इज दिस दिस रूल विच हेल्प्स यू टू रिमेंबर द ऑर्डर ऑफ ऑपरेशन टू बी फॉलोड वाइल सॉल्विंग expression or equation right so this b refers to the bracket then o represents order order means it can be a square root or exponent then remaining operations are its division multiplication addition and subtraction right then we'll move on to the question so in this in this type of question we will be uh, taking each option right we'll be taking each option and substitute in the given expression this is the way we can able to do so but here i am going to take the correct option so the right answer is its option d so i'll show you how to solve this one so just interchanging the addition and the division sign so instead of division we will be using here as addition sign and 14 into 30 plus so instead of plus we have to use division no 20 minus 10 equal to 12. So now we have to follow the board mass rule. So according to the board mass rule, we need to solve bracket first. After then, orders. But in this uh, equation, we don't have any uh, brackets and order of operation, right? So next we'll move on to the division. So this is the division part. So 1 plus 14 into 30 divided by 20 is it's 3 by 2 now. So you write. So first I'll write like this. Then only you will understand. We'll be writing like this. So then, zero zero get cancelled. So we'll be getting fourteen into three by two minus ten equal to two. Right. Then afterwards, after division, the priority goes to multiplication. So fourteen into three by two. This part you have to solve. So fourteen into three by two means this two get cancelled with fourteen for seven times. So remaining would be one plus. Seven into three minus ten equal to twelve. Again, we are having multiplication. So first, you have to solve seven threes are twenty one minus ten equal to twelve. So in this ex, uh, equation, again you are having addition and subtraction. So both addition and subtraction have the same priority. You can solve either of this. So one plus twenty one is twenty two minus ten equal to twelve. So remaining is twelve equal to twelve. So hence both LHS and RHS are equal. Then your answer would be its option D is the correct answer. Question number eight: Which of the following options satisfy the same conditions of placement of dots as in the given figure? So here we have three dots. Now this is let us assume this is one, two, and three. Right. Now take down the first dot. What is the region shared by the first dot? Yes, it is a square and a circle. Circle and a square. Then take down the second dot. This particular dot has shared the region of again circle, square, and then rectangle. Right. Then we'll take down the next, a third dot. This particular dot shared the region of. square then rectangle then triangle so now we'll try to place these dots in the given option option a circle and a square so which part is shaded by circle and square yes i can place in this i can place the first dot in this region then second dot should be placed in circle square and rectangle so which is the region yes we can place here no circle square and rectangle then third dot can be placed this particular dot has shared the region of triangle square and rectangle but in option a we cannot able to place the third dot so option a is wrong here because no region is shared by square rectangle and triangle then we'll move on to the option b So the first dot can be placed in this particular region. 
this region is shared by circle and square then second dot can be placed in circle square and rectangle no? so yes yes we can place here i can place a second dot in this region this particular region is shared by circle square and rectangle then last one is the region shared by circle sorry square triangle and rectangle no yes we can place it here right so this particular region is shared by circle rectangle and triangle so option b would be your right answer so this is the remaining option so finally option b is the right answer for this question question number 9 if it is possible to make only one meaningful english word with the first second fifth and eighth letters of the word technology using each letter only once then first letter of the word formed would be the answer if more than one such word can be formed then give is it as the answer if no such word can be formed then give why as the answer what is the first word sorry the first letter and then second second then fifth letter then eighth letter so take down t e n o so by these four letters we have to make a meaningful english word right so if more than one such word can be formed then give is it as the answer if only one word can be formed then the first letter of the word is the answer so i can make a word note meaningful english word is note and one more word we can also we can able to write that is stone so according to the question yes we can able to make more than one such word no so then your answer would be it is it hence option c is the right answer question number 10 select the correct water image of the given figure so what is water image inverted image is a water image right inverted image which means turning the object or turning the image upside down so when you turning the object upside down the top and bottom part of the image will be changed right top and bottom part of the image will be changed whereas left and left and right hand side of the image remains same left and right hand side of the image remains same so these are the key points you have to follow when you are doing water image problem right so finally what is the answer for this question yes its option b is the right answer next section is computers and information technology question number 11 dash storage is not under direct control of computer it must be required to connect physically to the computer system each time you want to use it options are online offline backup hierarchical storage the right answer is its option b offline storage question number 12 with the help of this icon you can dash in flash cs6 options are create a link between two symbols option b is move the stage up down right and left then option c is draw ready made fill pattern on the stage and option d is its create hand symbol so the particular icon in flash cx is yes it's a hand icon to create hand symbol option d is the right answer for this question question number 13 which of the following options is used to create a new blank table in design view 
in ms access 2010 now we'll see an example for this students first open microsoft ms access application then choose this blank database afterwards click on this create button it will create a table right it will create a table this is the default home page will open when you clicking on this application right so now the question is you have to create a new blank table in design view for this we are going to click on this create tab there you can find so many groups are there in this we are going to choose this table group so under the table group just click on this table design so by clicking this option you will get a blank table in design view right so this is what the question has been asked here then what about the remaining option again we'll see just click on this create app option b no that is application parts this icon represents application parts by clicking on this you can create a database or enter database of an application you can create then option c is form option so by clicking on this option you can create a form then option d is report option by clicking on this report you can create a report of this current table right so the question is by which option you can create a new blank table yes by clicking on this table design icon so the answer is it's option a so right answer for this question is it's option a this is table design option question number 14 mr mahesh had created a form and added the details of employees in ms access 2010 Which of the following options can he use to add company logo in each form? Option A, this is logo option. Then option B is its image icon. That is insert image icon. Then option C is title option. The last one is again it is an image option, but by clicking this particular icon, you can set the property of the inserted image right so this option b and d is both are different by using by clicking this particular icon that is an option b no by clicking this particular icon you can insert an image into the form from your local disk right but option d is you are going to set the property for the inserted image right both are different so the question is which option is used to add the company logo it's by clicking this logo icon you can insert a logo from your local disk that is from your computer itself you can you can insert the logo or you can browse from the online itself right so option a is the right answer for this question question number 15 match the ms access 2010 icons given in column 1 with their terms given in column 2 so in column 1 option a is the uh, selection icon option b is toggle filter icon then option c is advanced icon and option d is remove sort icon hence option b is the right answer question number 16 what is the most appropriate formula you can put in the cell b2 to calculate 9 percentage tax for the given data in ms excel 2010 so 9 percentage tax we have to calculate from this total Which means nine percentage of total, right? So this nine percentage can be written nine by hundred, and which is equal to point zero nine, right? Then point zero nine of total means point zero nine into total. So the total amount is they have given something thirty two thousand nine hundred ninety six like this, right? Now what is the cell reference? What is the cell reference of the total? Yes, this is A and this is two. Column into row A two. A two is the cell address of the total. So whenever you, if you are writing a formula, you have to put the equal sign right before the formula starts. So equal to then the cell address into point zero nine. So this is the most appropriate formula required. to calculate the percentage of tax hence the answer is its option a is the right answer question number 17 a name range is a description 
that you assign to a cell or group of cells. Select the incorrect statement regarding the name range of MS Excel 2010. Option A is it can begin with a letter and underscore sign as well as it cannot contain spaces. Then option C is it cannot correspond to cell coordinates in the worksheet. It may contain images. So which is the wrong one? Select the incorrect statement regarding the name range. Yes, it may contain images is the wrong statement. And so option D is the right answer for this question. Question number 18. Identify the name of the template with respect to the flash CH6. Options are animated button highlight, animated button text glow, then random movement brownian, random movement organic. The right answer is it's option C, random movement brownian. Question number 19. Select the incorrect match regarding the HTML colors value. In this we have three column. Value of color given in hexadecimal. Then color RGB. Then name of the color. Here we will take this column as for your reference. Now what is this RGB? 0, 0, 0. Yes, they have passed the value for red, green and blue color. So this number 0 signifies you there is no representation of the color then the final color it would be in black but this is not the case we need to find whether this hexadecimal value is is correct for this black color or not obviously it is correct because they have not passed any values they have simply passed zero no then hexadecimal value is also zero so a would be correct answer then coming to the next statement here they have passed 255 for red color and zero uh, zeros for green and blue color which means this 225 signifies you that the highest possible concentration of the color so which means the color would be its red color and we have to verify this hexadecimal value is correct for the red color or not right so what is the hexadecimal value here f f 0 0 0 so there are six digits are there right so now we'll make a group of two digits like this is for R, uh, this is for green and this is for blue. Already for green and blue color we have passed zero values no. So this is correct only. But we need to check whether this 255 is equal to EFF or not. So for this we have one formula. Take down. Here how many numbers are there? Two numbers are there. EFF no. So F represents 15 right. So this is first number and this is your second number just take down the first number what is the hexadecimal value of f it is 15 so multiply the first number with a 16 you will be getting 240 then take down the second number that is 15 multiply with 1 you will be getting 15 then add these two value you will be getting 255 so this f f represents 255 so finally option b is also correct then we'll move on to the option c here here they have passed 255 255 for r g and b as well right so just now we have found out this f f represents 255 right so we have to make a group of two so each group represents each color red green blue right so f f represents 255 EFF represents 255. Hence option C is also correct. Right. So finally we need to check whether D is correct or incorrect. Same way we will make a group of two digits. C0, C0, C0. Let's take down. What is the hexadecimal value for C? Yes, it is 12. No. Then multiply the first number with the 16. You will be getting 192. And multiplying the second number, always multiply the second number with 1. Don't forget. Don't multiply with 16. Just multiply with 1. You will be getting 0. Then adding these two values, the total becomes 192. So this C0 represents 192. Right. So now 192, here 192. But instead of 192 here, they have used 190. No? So it must be 192 here. So which is the incorrect one 
It's option D is the incorrect one. Question number 20. Identify the following. It is an electronic flash memory storage disk. It is commonly used in consumer electronic devices such as digital cameras, MP3 players, mobile phones and other smaller portable devices. It usually requires a device to access the data stored in it. So the first one is it's pen drive. It is also a flash memory, right? And this is a memory card or memory chip. And this is CD drive. And this is compact disc CD. It's a CD. Right. So the answer for this question is it's option B. Memory card or memory chip. Question number 21. Which of the following is the incorrect difference between primary and secondary memory? Option A. Primary is a temporary memory. Secondary is a permanent memory. Option B. Primary is directly accessible by processor whereas secondary memory is not directly accessible by CPU. Option C. Primary memory devices are based on semiconductor memories. Secondary memory devices are based on magnetic and optical memories. Option D. Examples of Examples of primary memory, hard disk, floppy disk. An example of our option D. Examples for primary memory, hard disk, floppy disk. Examples for secondary memory, it's RAM, random access memory, read only memory, catch memory, programmable read only memory and register. So here in option D, hard disk and floppy disk are secondary memory. Whereas RAM and ROM, these are all examples of primary memory. So which is incorrect, it's option 2. Question number 22. DAS is the smallest network which may include Bluetooth enabled or infrared devices. It has connectivity range up to 10 meters. Options are private area network, local area network, metropolitan area network and it is wide area network. Since it's a smallest network and its connectivity range up to 10 meters, so your answer would be its private area network. Question number 23. Option A. Router. It is a network device which combines features of both bridge and router. Option B. It's a gateway. It is used to connect two networks together that may work upon different networking models. Option C bridge it is used to either modulate or demodulate the signals option d is a repeater it is used to receive the signal and retransmit it over the same network so the question is which is incorrect over one the question is which is incorrect over here it's option c bridge because bridge is a network device it's a network device which used to connect, which is used to connect multiple local area networks. Multiple local area network, that is multiple LANs, right? And one more thing is, which is used to either modulate or demodulate the signals. The device which is used to modulate or demodulate, it's nothing but modem, right? So anyhow, option C is the incorrect match here. Question number 24. Identify the following. It is a numeric or alpha numeric code that is randomly and uniquely generated during each authentication event. It is generated on the server side and delivered to the authenticator via text message. This adds an additional layer of security as it is valid only for one login session options are unique password open password dynamic password and the last one is it's one time password so the right answer is it's otp that is one time password
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट होल्ड्स ट्रू अबाउट एम एस पावर पॉइंट टू थाउजेंड टेन स्टेटमेंट वन इट डज नॉट अलो यू टू रिकवर अन सेव्ड प्रेजेंटेशन दिस स्टेटमेंट इज फॉल्स बिकॉज इन एम एस पावर पॉइंट टू थाउजेंड टेन वी कैन एबल टू रिकवर अवर अन सेव्ड प्रेजेंटेशन एंड स्टेटमेंट टू इट प्रोवाइड सेवरल ऑप्शन फॉर प्रोटेक्टिंग योर प्रेजेंटेशन सो दिस इज ट्रू सो फाइनली योर आंसर इज वनली स्टेटमेंट टू इज ट्रू क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टोरेज डिवाइसेस कंटाइंस सर्कुलर डिस्क एट स्टैक्ड ऑन अ सेंट्रल स्पिंडल ऑप्शंस आर हार्ड डिस्क कॉम्पैक्ट डिस्क एंड डीवीडी देन रैंडम एक्सेस मेमोरी राइट सो द क्वेश्चन इज विच स्टोरेज डिवाइस कंटाइंस सर्कुलर डिस्क स्टैक्ड ऑन अ सेंट्रल स्पिंडल इट्स नथिंग बट हार्ड डिस्क क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी An operating system is a program that acts as an interface between the user and the computer hardware and controls the execution of all kinds of programs. Which of the following is not an important function of an operating system? Options are memory management, device management, identity management and option D is a file management. So the right answer is its identity management is the is not an important function of a operating system question number 28 which of the following features of ms excel 2010 gets activated when you press control plus f3 key keyboard shortcut options are name manager option b is inspect document option c is check accessibility option d is check compatibility the right answer is it's option a name manager question number 29 which of the following data type automatically generates a unique number for each record that's added to a table and is commonly used for primary key fields in ms access 2010 options are integer auto number character currency these are all data types right so the question is which data type automatically generate a unique number for each record that's added to a table so the right answer for this question is it's option b that is auto number Question number thirty: Which of the following devices is not mandatory for setting up a video conference? Option A is its web camera. Then this one is option B is its printer. Then option C is speaker. And option D is its mic. I can say it's a microphone, right? So, which is not mandatory for setting up a video conference? It's option B, printer. Question number thirty-one: What will be displayed in a cell if it contains the following formula in MS Excel two thousand ten? So, this question they have given round function. The purpose of this function is to round the number to a specified number of digits. Now, I tell you what is the syntax of this round function. Round number and num underscore digits. Num underscore digits. So what is this argument? Number yes, the number that you want to round, you have to type here. The next one is num underscore digits. This argument is the number of digits to which you want to round the number. Right, number of digits you want to round the number. So in this question, it is given that the num digit is it's one. So what it refers? Yes, you are going to round this particular number to one decimal place, right? One decimal place. And most important thing is, if num underscore digit is greater than zero, if num underscore digit is greater than zero means the number. Will be rounded to the specified decimal places to the right of the decimal point to the 
right of the decimal point so this particular part is going to be round off keep in mind if number of digit num underscore digit is greater than 0 the number will be rounded to the specific decimal places to the right of the decimal point so here what is the specified decimal places here the argument is 1 so I am going to round off this number to 1 decimal places so finally my answer is 2345.8 2345.8 is the right answer. Option C is the right answer. Question number 32 dash is the most popular LAN technology. Option A is it's DSML directory directory service markup language. DSL is directory service markup language then option b is ethernet option c is ssl is nothing but secure socket layer the last one is ipv v6 it's nothing but internet protocol version Internet protocol version 6. So which is the most popular LAN technology? Yes, it's option B, Ethernet. Question number 33. Which of the following built-in program is used by operating system to boot up the computer system? Option A, system call, spooling, buffering, BIOS. What is BIOS here? It's basic input or output system input or, or output system right so which is the built-in program is used by the operating system to boot up the computer is nothing but it's option D bias question number 34 which of the following statement holds true about the hub label in the given diagram of topology statement 1 as long as the hub is working, it can be used to monitor link problems and bypass defective links. Statement 2. If hub goes down, the whole system is dead. So, which is true about hub topology. Both the statement 1 and 2, both are true regarding hub topology. Hence, your answer is its option. C is the right answer. Question number 35. Using the slideshow tab in MS PowerPoint 2010, you can dash, create the custom slideshow, insert clip art, option C is insert text box, option D is insert table. So using the slideshow tab, I can insert or I can create the custom slideshow. It's option A is the right answer. Question number 36. Select the correct option with respect to third generation of computer. Option A, vacuum tubes. B is transistor. Option C is very large scale integration. Then option D is its integrated circuit. So the right answer for this question is its option D. Question number 37. Which of the following is not a section in the tools panel in flash CSX? Options are drawing section stage section color section and selection section the right answer is its option b stage section question number 38 dash is heads up display that allows user to interact with stimulated environment and experience a first person view options are virtual reality headset infrared headset fire headset and quick headset the right answer is its option A, virtual reality headset. Question number 39, what would be the output of the given HTML code? So in HTML, the codes always starts with HTML tag and the main content of the program would starts with body tag. Here they have used UL tag. What is UL tag is it defines unordered list. It defines unordered list. 
so in unordered list the list items begins with li tag so they have used li tag so which means this list contain two items one is coffee and an tea then again they are again they are using unordered list so this program contains two ul tag two ul tag which means it's nested unordered list nested unordered list which means list inside another list nested list means list inside another list so we consider this unordered list is a main list and this particular list is a unordered list as a nested list again this nested list list contains some more items like black tea green tea and milk these items are begin with the l i tag then afterwards they are closing the unordered list and closing the body tag and closing the html tag right so now what would be the output of the program so in unordered list the list items does not have any specific order does not have specific order or sequence right does not have any order or sequence so the list items are always marked with bulleted list so the list items always marked with bullets right so now move on to the option so finally what would be the answer for this sir what would be the output of this program yes it's obviously it's c so this is these items are from main list and these items are from sub list or nested list you can see you no know, here you are you we are using two different type of bullets to differentiate the nested list but in option b you can see you no know, same type of bullet is used you no know, that is wrong so sorry i done a mistake here you can see you no know, same type of same type of bullet has been used here that's why option b is wrong question number 40 identify the following it connects monitor to computer's video card it has 15 holes it is similar to serial port connector but serial port connector has pins this port has holes options are firewire port usb port vga port and parallel port the right answer is its option c vga port vga means its video graphics array video graphics array option c is the right answer question number 41 sometimes due to the heavy use of the computer system some unnecessary files are created and stored on the disk which of the following features of an operating system is used for checking files that are not frequently used or the files that were created for temporary purpose in windows 7 options are windows defender disk cleanup file archiver option d is its antivirus the right answer is its option c file archiver so the right answer is it's option b disk cleanup question number 42 dash is a network of devices that has been infected with malicious software such as virus where attackers can control it without the owner's knowledge question number 41 sometimes due to the heavy use of the computer system some unnecessary files are created and stored on the disk which of the following features of an operating system is used for checking files that are not frequently used or the files that were created for temporary purposes in windows 7 options are windows defender disk cleanup file archiver antivirus the right answer is its option b disk cleanup question number 42 dash is a network of devices 
that has been infected with malicious software such as virus where attackers can control it without the owner's knowledge with the goal of increasing the magnitude of their attack options are malware botnet phishing zero day exploit the right answer is it's option b botnet question number 43 which of the following options is not a type of wrong option a it's e e p room electrically erasable programmable e e pro means electrically erasable programmable read only memory right then what is m rom m rom is nothing but mask read only memory mask m for mask mask read only memory then option c is p rom p rom means p stands for programmable programmable read only memory then option d is e m r o m so the question is which is not the type of rom yes it's obviously d e m rom we don't have any kind of e m r o m memory right this is not the type of type of rom and one more thing is we don't have anything in this name that is e m r o m so option d is a right answer for this question question number 44 which of the following is not categorized as style of line tool properties in flash cs6 options are stippled hatched ragged plain the right answer is it's option d plain question number 45 which of the following steps will provide you the options to translate a complete ms word 2010 document from one language to another now we'll see an example for this students the question asked here is the options which used to translate a complete ms word document from one language to another right so for this we need to click on this review tab you can see here so many groups are there proofing language commands tracking changes compare protect ink one or these are the groups under the review tab right so the question is have to translate your document from one language to another so for this we have to choose this language group in this language group you can see you know this is the translate option so by using this translate option you can translate your document from one language to another right so the answer is it's option a is the right answer for this question the next section is achiever section question number 46 identify the types of media referred as x and y in the given statement x refers to it consists of two separate insulated copper wire which are color coded then y it is a type of cable that is used for telephone communication and most modern ethernet networks the right answer is so we have option no so the options are infrared and optical fiber cable in option b x is a radio wave and y is twisted pair cable then option c x is microwave and y is twisted pair cable whereas option d is x is twisted pair cable and y is coaxial cable so the right answer for this question is two separate insulated two separate insulated copper wire no which are color coded so it must be a twisted pair cable so x is twisted pair cable then it's a type of cable that is used for telephone communication and most modern ethernet network is its coaxial cable option d is the right answer 
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सेवन मैच द की बोर्ड शॉर्ट कट्स गिवन इन कॉलम वन विद द टास्क दे परफॉर्म गिवन इन कॉलम टू विद रेस्पेक्ट टू फ्लैश सी ए सिक्स सो इन कॉलम वन फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज कंट्रोल प्लस ऑल्ट प्लस टी सो वेन यू प्रेसिंग दो कीज यू विल बी गेटिंग टाइम लाइन ऑप्शन देन प्रेसिंग कंट्रोल प्लस एफ थ्री यू विल बी गेटिंग प्रॉपर्टीज देन बाई प्रेसिंग एफ थ्री की यू विल बी गेटिंग फाइंड अगेन then pressing control plus f10 together you will be getting history so finally your answer is it's option a is the right answer question number 48 which of the given options can give the following output in html so in this question they have given you a chemical formula so in order to get the output like this we need to use some two tags most important tag one is sub tag another one is sup tag what is sub tag it's nothing but subscript subscript and sup is superscript see in chemical formulas uh, some numbers are in subscript and some numbers are in superscript so take down the 6 and 2 and 24 these three number are subscript whereas this six is a superscript right so go through the option uh, the answer for this question is its option b right so in general uh, the subscript uh, characters always appear below the normal line always appear below the normal line in smaller font right subscript uh, text would always appear below the normal line and in smaller font similarly the text between this superscript tag would always appear on upper baseline so see here it's an upper baseline in smaller font size right so just go through the option then finally your answer is it's option b question number 49 which of the following is a mail protocol used for accessing email on a remote web server from a local client and it enables to take any action such as downloading and deleting the mail from the server itself first one is pop3 it's nothing but post office protocol post office protocol iamap it's nothing but internet internet messaging access protocol then option c is smtp it's simple mail transfer pro protocol transfer protocol then last one is it's http it's nothing but hyper http is hypertext transfer protocol right hypertext transfer protocol so which is the mail protocol used for accessing email on a remote web server from a local client right so the answer is it's option b internet messaging access protocol that is iamap Question number fifty: Which of the following options is used to combine documents from multiple sources in one document and also helpful for work on a shared document with colleagues or coworkers in MS Word two thousand ten? Now we'll see an example for this. Students, in this question, they have asked you to find out which option. is used to combine documents from multiple sources into one documents it's nothing but you are going to merge two documents right two documents from different sources this is what the question has been asked here so now where do you find this combine option that is merge option in ms word 2010 just click on this review tab there you can find compare tool na so you just click on this you can see you know this is the combine option so this is what the question has been asked here when you click on this option you can find or you can get the more options to merge 
documents of different sources into a one document right so finally what is the answer for this question is it's option a then we'll check the remaining option also what is b here it's option b is nothing but accept accept and the third option is it's reject option right reject option and the last one is option d is it's track changes right so finally the option a is is the right answer for this question hope you all like this video thanks for watching